On Friday, April 26th, the UMass football program made a giant step forward as it unveiled the official groundbreaking ceremony of the new UMass Football Performance Center and the new renovations to McGurk Stadium. The ceremony began at 10 a.m. in front of McGurk with honorary speakers addressing the crowd. These speakers included UMass Chancellor Subhaswamy, UMass President Robert Carrett, University of Massachusetts Chair Henry M. Thomas, Massachusetts Senate Majority Leader Stan Rosenberg, Executive Director Catherine Craven, Athletic Director John McCutcheon, and Head Football Coach Charlie Molnar. Afterwards, these officials gathered for the official shoveling of the dirt in front of the construction site. Athletic Director John McCutcheon spoke afterwards for the reasons of the renovation. Obviously the, the McGurk Stadium is, is about 50 years old and nothing significant had, had happened down there physically uh, really during that whole entire period until we put in artificial surface and lights a couple years ago. So, uh, And the facilities that the football program were using really were in, insufficient even had we stayed at the, the 1AA level or F, FCS level. Um, for the long term. The $34.5 million project includes a 55,000 square foot performance center, complete with coaches' offices, a new locker room space, meeting rooms, athletic training facilities, and a strength and conditioning facility. A new press box will accommodate the wide range of media, while state-of-the-art skybox lounges will host various alumni and guests. Not only will visible improvements to the facilities be seen by fans on game day, but McCutcheon believes that this will result in improvements on the playing field as well. So having the support building right here on campus next to where they practiced, went next to where they're going to play, uh, is going to be a, a, a fantastic resource to them on a recruiting basis and also on a daily usage basis. I think we'll have short-term impacts, but I think we'll have even greater long-term impacts. And these improvements uh, that will enable us to be more competitive with some of the lead programs. All of these things position the overall athletic department for what may develop down the road. The project is scheduled to be completed by summer of 2014 with home games scheduled at McGurk for the 2014 season.